In the Shattered Relics Lease, we can do stuff we normally cannot do in the normal game. That is because we can obtain fragments and relics that makes our account stronger. And in this episode, I want to try out one of the more overpowered relics in the game, which is Knife's Edge combined with Twin Strikes. Knife's Edge work like Darox. For every hit point missing, you deal additional damage in all combat styles, up to 0.6% damage increase per hit point. And I also want to use Twin Strikes, which have a 63% chance of hitting twice in the same hit. So theoretically speaking, if I were to have these two relics combined with full Darox, I could potentially hit 300. And there's only one way to find out. <laughs> yeah, it's just fun, because I don't have to do shit. Yes! Yes! I got Good the you. Darox Fleet Legs! Oh, nice. Oh my god. Oh my, yes! Myths. Yes! Oh, right. oh nice, yes! dude. dude it's actually items. happening. The dream, the Darok bombing dream. It's, it's actually gonna happen. All right, anything? Oh, oh, oh! Um, oh yes! Oh my no god. Way. We're no, going no away. No way. Darok sound. Wow. We don't have that dupe yet. You're actually, you're actually one piece away from the age. And with three out of four Darox pieces obtained, we only needed that Darox Great Axe. But after hours and days of not obtaining it, I started to lose patience. I wanted to quit. But then suddenly... <gasps> yes! Oh my god! Yes! We're done! We're done! Yes! The Darox Axe, 303 kill count. It's over. Oh my god, I was so dry, I didn't get anything for 200 kill count. That's our third set completed. Oh my god, let's get out of here. Uh, previous, I have the axe. Yes, beautiful, get out, get out. Full DH completed. And now that the Barrow's grind is over, we need to upgrade all our strength bonuses so we can hit as high as we possibly can. The first upgrade being a strength amulet from the Under Druids. And after a few minutes of killing dragons, we now have 70 prayer. We can now use Piety, the strongest melee prayer of all. Next upgrade is the Fire Cape, and we're here at Jad. There's actually a task where you need to tank a hit from Jad without overhead, so... There we go. Magic. Now we can go lose HP. Imagine if we can one hit Jad. That would be the dream. Here we go. Good luck. Nope. Zero. Seven to two. There we go. Seven to nine. Kill before spawners. Healers. Oh my god, that hit! Hell yeah, three. We needed three big hits. And we did it. Let's go. Fire Cape have been unlocked. And that's 125 League Points for equipping a Fire Cape. Beautiful. 109. Oh my god. And I'm not even... F I don't even have gloves yet. Disaster fight? What did you have to do for all that, Tom? A lot. I did like five quests to reach this stage. Oh my that's god. Insane. Five? Finally, we get an upgrade. After one day, we get our next upgrade. Barosian Gloves. That is correct, and we get 500. We don't even get points. All right, let me one hit this greater demon. Thank you. No. I think it needs like four or five hits, buddy. Give me a 100. There we go. Thank you. 98 strength. Okay. Another one. Oh hit. my god, dude. Well, another one hit. Oh my god. Quad what? kill? That's fuck. Oh, only three kills in a row. That's horrible, dude. That's so bad. I'm starting to feel how close we are to actually having some fun here with the max hits. And this should be the level. Yep, 99 strength, 99 hit points. We are done. Uh, there's a few upgrades we still can get. I think we're gonna go for the Berserk Ring right now. So for that, we need to unlock a new boss. That boss being the Dagonaut Kings. Yes, another beautiful upgrade. A Berserk Ring have been obtained. And we get some points. Beautiful. 650k, we have an imbued Berserk Ring. Our strength bonus is now 141. We can still upgrade the boots, the gloves, and the cape. But for now, I'm gonna be very happy with this. We're just gonna smash out bosses one by one. And one of the easiest bosses to smash out is going to be Giant Maul, 10 points. I'm just gonna one hit it really quickly and then go to the next boss. <gasps> there it is, one hit. 
for a 200 damage oh my god 13 kill count that's what we needed for that one hit back to back one hits maybe nah never lucky man the next boss on my list is a massive gamble but I think I'm gonna have so much fun. We are going to unlock Dragon Slayer 2 to be able to kill Vorkath. And an extra bonus by unlocking Dragon Slayer 2 is that we can get this orb, which is gonna damage us 10 at a time instead of the Dwarven Rock Cake, which is like once in six. But before we do Vorkath, we need to unlock this Haunted Mine for the Solve Shard, a Solve Amulet. Since Vorkath is an undead, we're gonna get plus 15 strength bonus by ju just using a salve amulet. And after grinding Herblore for over 5 hours, we can now make anti-fires for Vorkat. Now that I am finally ready for Vorkat, I decided to test it out. However, after dying 4 times, I came to the realization that I need to unlock tier 6 for an additional fragment spot. And after a few hours, I unlocked tier six for that extra fragment spot. All right, we made some more money from revs, so uh, we can die more at Vorkath. All right, we are back at Vorkath. Some changes here. We got two more set effects, absolute unit. We got Dragon's Touch, and then of course, Knife's Edge and Twin Strikes. DDS kill maybe? 54 with the deal and there he is it's over defeat Vorkat 50 points So now that we have successfully killed Vorkat we want to go for those big hits big numbers and quick kills <gasps> Oh my god, you see that? Oh my god <gasps> Oh my god as big as it is so far <gasps> Oh my god Holy shit, what a quick kill. What time was that? 0.59! No way! No way! I completed elite master task, speedrunner task. I decided to upgrade my inventory with Gutex Restores. This way I can tick it every hit without losing DPS. Double 100. This could be it. Another big hit. Oh my, well that was four big hits. Is that a new PB? 0.46, oh my god, it's getting stronger and stronger. We're gonna move on from Vorkat, but as I'm editing this video, I found out that it is possible to two hit Vorkat using Darox. But then again, it's very RNG based and you need some upgrades. Oh god, Dragon, you must get one hit, thank you. Oh. Oh my, we hit it! What? Is that like 150 HP and we one hit it? Level 96. And he's dead. It's a drive by kill. Oh, a major is here. And the major is dead. One hit the orc as well? Oh, let's try out this boss, Arachnis. I got one dose super strength left. Ooh, 170, first kill, hit. Oh, that was a 3 hit, I think. I'm gonna save that clip. Quarm. Okay, upgrade, uh, granite mod. I didn't even think about the granite mod, but with the special discount fragment, we can hit 4 times with the granite mod. Oh my god, big kill, big kill. Was that a two hit plus the Gmail? Yeah, I don't really like peeking unless it's for uh, resources and my resource right now in the wilderness is Revenant Dragons. G.I.M. Relic. <laughs> my resources. I died! I think I'm gonna try out one final boss, which is gonna be the King Black Dragon. I'm gonna use the method where I stand under KBD and hit him while he can't hit me back until I hit big. 31. <gasps> oh my Jesus Christ! Oh my God. All right, guys, I need you to answer me honestly. There is enough bosses and there's enough upgrades to make one more leaks video if you guys would like that. Or would you prefer if I went back to my PvP Hardcore Iron Man and Adventure videos? 
after this video right here. Uh, let me know in the comments because I I still haven't decided if I want to do one more video or not. And with that being said, can we get five thousand luck? Thank you. Okay, there it is. I don't actually know if this works. We this is the first time testing it. But if you give a bone to this dog, the stray dog. I love you. <laughs> it did work. It did work. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's all.